Hey everyone, welcome back. Today we're taking a look at these new dinosaur and human pack from Jurassic World Chaos Theory. These just came out earlier this week. Um, I got these from Big Bad Toy Store and it was actually basically retail price. Amazon had them up for sale earlier this month but it hasn't shipped yet. And these are also being found in Universal Studios currently. So this is the Kanji and Sticky Moloch 2-pack. Really cool. Um, it has one of Kenji's outfit, and it has a uh, sticky mullet along with a uh, health pack, and then um, that looks to be like the T Rex um, Young's little um, band aid along with the guns that we see from the show, the the tranquilizer gun looking things, and this is the rest of the wave. It comes with Yaz uh, and also Darius. So sticky mullet, Kenji. All right, let's open this one and check it out. All right, so open up the figure set. Um, so this is the Kenji Defender Pack with sticky mullet. So the first thing we're gonna look at is the cool little first aid kit. This is the second time we got this. This is a repack from Fallen Kingdom. And it's pretty cool. You can put the leg of the dinosaur there. And also open up and you have little blood packs. So this is a kind of a first aid kits rescue set. So Sticky Molek also comes with a band-aid that you can take on and off. I chose to put it on just to show you guys how how it kind of works. So there you go. You put it on to save your dinosaur. There you go. It fits pretty well. I believe we got very similar, if not the same one, for Young Rex. And then it also comes with these guns that they use on the show. Pretty nice. Little tranquilizer gun looking things. Um, so the first thing we're going to look at will be the Stigamolic. Um, it lacks a lot of paint. It's a very basic painted figure. I would say is definitely an action size dino danger, dino pack size figure. It lacks a lot of um, deco though. It does have stripes on top here that are painted. Along with the head, the horns are painted. Really nice. And it's more cream than it used to be. It used to be more silverish. And the top of the dome is painted along with the beak and the neck. Well, not even the neck, the chin. And the rest of the figure is not painted. So like I said, it's a danger pack size dinosaur. So it has the basic articulation of the head, no neck articulation at all, along with the arms and the legs. And they actually have quite a bigger role this time around in um, Chaos Theory. So that's pretty cool. We got the, we got to see this along with a few different color ones. And this is a set. So this is the second one we're getting. The first one we got was from the Darius set at Target in a different deco. As you can see, these two are basically parallel to each other as far as deco. Um, the same amount of paint, but just different color dinosaurs. And actually, I got one from... Fallen Kingdom, pretty similar, way smaller than the one we have now, as you can see. How much bigger it is, the new one. So they definitely upsize Stiggy compared to the old one we have. And the old one has way more deco. Look, you see some on the thighs, all the way down to the tail. The stomach is painted. So this is the Sticky Molek that we get from the pack. And here is the code that you can already scan. And then to me, the best part of the pack would be getting more human figures. So this is Kenji from the new show. This is from the beginning of the show that he has this outfit on. This is one of the two outfits that's currently available now. So as far as Kenji goes, he has a new haircut um likeness is okay 
he has head articulation along with arms and elbow, along with the hip, you're able to turn at the hip, and the legs and the knees, but no ankles. So it's nice that we actually got a couple of different uh, variants of outfits of the characters that are coming out. So this one is one of the first ones that we're getting. There's another Kenji coming out with a Strasser Raptor and a uh, bike from the show. So overall, I feel like this is a cool set. Um, it has quite a few reused parts from other sets. The Kenji is new, along with the Sigmolic is, is new for Chaos Theory. And it's kind of in the original Fallen Kingdom color. I like it. Um, it was actually All right. The next person we can compare it to will be Camp Cretaceous Kenji. I think it's a better figure, Camp, uh, Camp Cretaceous one. Um, basically, exactly same articulation, but I feel like it just looks more like the CGI model than this one that we got with the weird eye that we're getting. Um, same articulation, but as you can see, just a few years older. Same height and everything. That's pretty cool. Like old Kenji and future Kenji. But as far as uh, these packs, uh, final thought. I think they're awesome. I feel like it's a great value for what it is. I um, They're what, $16? You get a dinosaur and a human along with accessories. Um, these are being found now at... Big Bad Toy Store, they have them in, they have them in stock actually right now. If you go um, Big Bad Toy Store right now, um, Amazon had taken order, but it has not shipped them yet. I got an email from them saying that they will let me know when it's ready to ship, but it hasn't been the case. It's been a couple of weeks now, and also these are also being found at Universal Studios gift shop, but I'm sure they're like almost thirty bucks there. Um, these are notorious for not easier to be found besides movie year. Um, Camp Cretaceous ones are horribly hard to find this whole time. We found them in Macy's and Big Bad Toy Store. And Ben and Bumpy's actually going for a lot of money now these days. So I will pick them up as you see them now. Um, I think it's cool for $15, $16, you get a, a human. I love these. Um, there's variants on these human figures, so you're not just getting the same Darius, the same Kenji. That's pretty cool. And also, smart reuse of the accessories we have. Now we have band-aids for uh, dinosaurs. It just comes with a great play, um, play pattern for kids alike. So yeah, Stiggy isn't the most popular dinosaur, but it is on the show, and I love that it's being represented in the toy line. So... Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Like and subscribe.